Hey you guys and welcome back to another day of Vlogmas. This is the Franklin Foundations. My name is Katie. If you are new, I'm a young mother of three and a wife as well. And here on my channel, I like to share just faith-based videos, motherhood videos, wifehood videos, womanhood videos, literally anything that would pertain to the lifestyles of those topics. But we are in an interesting season. This is Vlogmas, where I'm releasing a video a day for 25 days leading up to Christmas. I have covered, I don't know what all, and I'm a just about halfway there. Today I have a very exciting video for you guys, and it is another recipe video. <laughs> I hope you all are enjoying these because I sure am. Today I'm gonna to show you all how to make a very, very delicious and so easy crock pot soup called white chili. I had never heard of this until I began attending the church where me and my family now go. I've been here, been there for almost five years. But anyways, this is like very famous, very well known around our church quarters. That's where I got this recipe from. It is probably one of my all time favorites and I'm so excited to share it with you guys today. So please stick around, watch and enjoy and let me know if you decide to try it down below. For this recipe, you will need a pound of chicken, I prefer the tenderloins, a can of kidney beans, a can of black beans, a can of great northern white beans, a can of chili beans, two cans of mild diced tomatoes or rotel, two eight ounce packages of cream cheese, and one package of the ranch seasoning mix. The very first thing you will do is cook the chicken in boiling water for 30 minutes. While your chicken is cooking, you will add all other ingredients to your crock pot. Now for all of the canned ingredients, I pour in the juices and all from the rotel and the beans as well. You will then heat this on high for four hours. The next thing you will do is shred your cooked chicken. I find using a handheld mixer so much easier, but beware, it can get a little messy. Once you are done, add it to the crock pot, stir it real good, even though I didn't show this, cover it and let it cook. And after four hours, this is what you're left with. The flavors are incorporated so well. It is so good. And it is definitely a great dinner for the winter season that we are in. There are so many good fixings you can add to this. Some that I like are tortilla chips. And later you'll see me add in buffalo sauce. But I've also known of people adding in crackers, shredded cheese, sour cream. The list can go on and on. This is a wrap for our video today. If you decide to try this, please let me know in the comments down below how you liked it. Give it a thumbs up if you've ever tried this before and it is a family fave for you as well. Subscribe if you haven't already so you can stay tuned and be in contact whenever more videos are posted for Vlogmas and in the new year. Thanks you guys.